Hi honeys, how's your day going so far? Mine is going fine. Okay, you all seem to enjoy the last time I showed some of my favorite things. So, here I am again. We'll start off with this. My Jergens. My Jergens lotion with the original scent, cherry almond. It works. It cuts the ash. And it smells so good. Okay. What else? Something else. Okay, something I like to. Okay, I drink a lot of water. And sometimes I don't even want to taste water no more. I want to add something to it. So, I use true lemon. I use true lime. True grapefruit. And I got some true orange, but it has sugar. A little bit of sugar in it. Like 0 0.2. Okay. I like the grapefruit the best. And it's all good. It flavors your water, so your water ain't so bland. And when I want it to be sweetened, uh, this is my sweetener of choice. What is this? Agave? Agave? Well, anyway, this here. Get this from Amazon. I got the real lemon from Amazon. The true lemon from Amazon. Okay, I had bought this monk fruit sweetener. It sweetens, but I like the agave, agave better. This is a powder. And it does sweeten. And it's safe for diabetics to use. Safer than the agave, but I like the agave the best, so that's what I use. I love this big old mug. It holds a lot, so I don't, I don't have to be uh, refilling it so often. Water, and then I put the packets, a couple packets of the true lemon in here and a squirt of the agave. Got me a good beverage. Okay, get that out of my way. What else? Oh. Okay, I'm going to show y'all what I've been using for about a week now. You know how when you go to the uh, nail shop, Start to say something that wasn't politically correct. I had to catch myself. I'm getting better. That's why I don't go live because I might say anything. When you go to the nail shop and you get a pedicure, they use something like this. This is usually green. Ooh, mess up my nail. I've been using this and my feet, my heels, the bottom of my feet are just as smooth as Mackay's. Okay, very nice. I'll leave the link. And I've been putting this foot cream on me. Dr. Show's Ultra Hydrating Foot Cream. For the rough, cracked heels and things. Put this on and put some socks on. And if I don't use this, I'll put just plain Vaseline on and put the socks on. It works. But you have to get to the nitty gritty with this first. Okay, what else I got? Oh, something that I co-wash my hair with. I've shown y'all before. It's called Mixed Chicks Deep Conditioner. I just bought the big bottle because I use it so often. So what I do is wet my hair, put a couple pumps of this on my hair, and then I back up to the, the shower. Let the water just flow down. And while the water is flowing, I use this. It's called wet brush, but you can use your Denman brush. Any of these type of brushes with these kind of bristles. And just brush it while you're in the shower and while the, run, uh, the water is running. And of course, some of your hair gonna come out, you know, 
So catch it. Make sure ain't nothing going down the drain. Okay. Well, that's what I use. Something else I use in the shower. I forgot what this is called. Well, I can't talk about it if I don't know what it's called. Oh, Billy. The Billy Razor. Uh, you can get these through subscriptions. <clears throat> Um, I forgot how much they cost because I've stopped my subscription because I got a bunch of them. It comes with the nice, how many blades is this? Looks like it's five blade razor. And it comes with a little thing you can stick to your shower wall and hang this up on the shower wall. I'll leave the information in my description box for Billy razors. You can choose your color. And Lynette Longmire, she told me about this. Okay, what else I got here? Okay, somebody asked me what I use on my face. Okay. I'm trying to get perfect, beautiful skin. I ain't there yet. I use CeraVe Acne Control Cleanser. And I put it in my pump bottle. It makes it foam. So that's what it looks like. I like for it to foam and just saturate the foam all over my face. Let it sit a few minutes. So the, what's in here? Salicylic acid can get down in the skin. So. And then I take one of my clean cloths, my clean skin cloths, and this, this is all I use on my face. Y'all can't see it. Can y'all see that? This is all I use on my face, y'all, because my face, my skin has issues. So I don't dare put a washcloth on my face. I use that. I'll leave the link for that again. I, I think I talked about it last time. Okay, what else I use for my hair? No, I use this for my wigs. Shea Moisture Frizz Free Curl Mousse on my curly and wavy wigs. When they're looking kind of rough and they need to be rejuvenated, this is what I use. When uh, my daughter Angelique was here, she was using this on her hair. She got that curly wavy hair. I mean, it's made for your hair. I just use it on my wigs. But she used it on her hair. And it did her hair good. She said, oh, mama, where you get this? From the store. <laughs> okay. So Wanda is still here. And she didn't take it back with her. And something else that I really, really like to do when I'm bored or Walter didn't get on my nerves. I like these word search books. Here's the newest one. And I like to do them with uh, different color pens. So I find that the Sharpies are the best pens you can, uh, well, in my opinion. So I've tried alcohol pens, I've tried gel pens, I've tried regular pens. And these are the Sharpie Fine Point Permanent Markers. And if you get you a nice enough book like this, it's not going to really bleed through. You don't like this. Let me see if it bled through on the other side. A little bit. Well, I still like it. Okay. And, you know, Bible word search books. Okay, takes my mind off of stuff. And what else I got here? Oh. Okay, everybody. This is something that could interest everybody. One of these things for charging up your cell phones, your tablets. 
it got the double thing so you can charge two things at one time you plug it in the wall so I'll leave the link to this and something else I just bought a couple days ago it's um it's called Northern Lights well anyway it's this I can't read the rest of the words on it I use it as a top coat for my nail wraps instead of just putting clear I recently bought some Amazon nail wraps and I got the marble kind that's what I got on now and it's time to do them again and I put a coat of this glitter hollow it's a holographic glitter in here you have to really shake it up each time you use it and you you can't see the beauty that the glitter when the light hits it a certain way you can see the glitter but I usually prefer to put on glitter nail wraps but I saw the marble design in different colors so this is what they look like and this is an Amazon brand and it looks like I'm not sure if this is wear or if they shrunk I'm not sure but I'm gonna do them over okay but to me they work as well as the Lillian Fox okay what I started off buying and you put a coat of this on top of them that make them sparkle it's a subtle glitter and you know it's not rough at all you can't feel it it's just like a top coat with oomph to it you know but you do have to really shake it up so can I read it now so I got this in silver and I got this in gold and they look the same to me I did this in silver I did this one in gold and they look exactly the same to me okay what else do I have in here that's it okay thanks for watching some of my favorite things so this might be a thing if y'all continue to like this let me know okay thanks for watching give me a thumbs up leave a nice comment and subscribe to my channel a lot of y'all watching y'all not even subscribed child it's free why don't you subscribe you know what I'm trying to get my uh, plaque for my hundred thousand subscribers okay if everybody watching me subscribe I probably had a million <laughs> anyway I appreciate the ones who watch me and not subscribe I appreciate the ones who have subscribed thank you everybody so y'all be blessed okay bye I want to hold something up I'm holding my book and my markers. Okay.